hi welcome back in today's session we would like to explore uh, the different uh, tools and options of sql server management studio as we have already installed sql server management studio in our computer in the previous video just go to the start menu type here sql server management studio here is the sql server management studio is installed on our computer just click on this to launch the sql server management studio this is the splash screen of the SQL Server Management Studio and the SQL Server Management Studio is loading in background. After successful load of the SQL Server or launch of the SQL Server Management Studio, we can see here a pop-up dialog that is automatically appeared on the SQL Server Management Studio. This dialog op contains multiple options regarding with the configurations or connectivity of the database already we have installed the database sql server we can explore this these features or functions or object of this dialog the first object is called the database engine this says that the which database engine is going to be used the second option is called the database name and the third one is the uh, important option that is called the authentication or authentication means the authentication of the user whether it is using sql server authentication mechanism or using the windows authentication mechanism in this uh, option or the by default we are using the windows authentication mechanism here are multiple options are also available in the sql server uh, launch dialog here is the encryption option and the other parameters but we will like to go through the default configuration options just click on the connect button it is going to the connect via the default database server that is the sql server we can see here this is the sql server database name that we have already seen in the pop-up dialog of the sql server management studio okay Uh, in the SQL Server Management Studio, there are the multiple sections of the user interface we can see here. Uh, we would like to explore it one after another. The topmost section is called the SQL Server Management Studio title bar. It is displaying the title of the SQL Server Management Studio. We can uh, see here the SQL Server Management Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. The second one uh, is the option of the menu bar. Here we can see multiple options regarding with the menus such as file, edit tools, etc. The third one bar is the or the partition of the SQL Server Management Studio is called toolbar. This will is containing the quick tools that are used to perform different kind of operations such as writing queries, selecting the database system, redo, undo, visual studio configuration and setting the top rightmost bar is the called search bar we can uh, launch the quick search or find the quick options regarding with the sql server management studio the most important and frequently used uh, option or the section of the sql server management studio is called toolbox this is the toolbox where we will have to inject each and every uh, operations here are multiple options we will like to explore it one after another this is called the object browser the first one option is called the connect this is used to connect to the particular database here we can also see the two uh, switch buttons icons that are used to connect or disconnect there is a small cross button on the switch option or icon this is used to disconnect from the current database server this is used to establish a connection and the uh, this is the refresh button and uh, this the last one icon is used to show the stats of the sql server that uh, how much memory consumption or how much processing is used by the sql server and the uh, other options including the objects of the database such as the databases security objects server objects and replication we will later on explore these all things in our uh, sql server management studio so i would like to uh, uh, appreciate you to subscribe our channel for the all to all latest updates about the sql server management studio okay here are the some important configurations uh, regarding with the sql server management studio we have to go to the tools option 
tools menu option here are the multiple options available in the tools section or tool menu button we would like to explore the options dialog that will be appeared here option dialog contains the multiple options regarding the, with the configuration of the sql server management studio i would like to uh, share you with the uh, common options that are mandatory uh, by that that are mandatory concerning about the writing queries and the configurations setting up the databases this is called fonts and colors object the other option is also called text editor we can also uh, check or uncheck or explore all other options regarding with our writing queries and typing queries and interaction with the database in the first one we will like to explore the font option here is the multiple options available regarding with the font specification of the sql server management studio the phase is that we have to create uh, select the uh, property option from here then we will have to choose the font style here we would have to select the font uh, size we can also click on the default for using the defaults we can also click on the custom buttons for items background and foreground this is the seventh number that is uh, appearing here the uh, appearance of the text that is modified in uh, with the help of this dialog box the edited or modified uh, options for the font specification will be shown impact on the query editor uh, i would like to click on the ok the most frequently used uh, shortcut key i would like to share with you is the control n we can see here we have pressed here the control n control n uh, shortcut key in sql server management studio is used to open a new query editor we can see here this is the new query editor as the new query editor uh, open there are multiple options that are enabled or controls are enabled on the top of the screen we can uh, view here there are the multiple options that are the toolbars available on the top of the screen i would like to simulate it again for you if we uh, close this query editor window i would like to close uh, we can see here the multiple options have disabled we can uh, minutely or keenly observe that the master database uh, option is now disabled or grade and other options such as query editor query undo redo copy paste etc this is the new query options we can see here the option uh, is uh, in the parenthesis control plus n this is the shortcut key for this toolbar button we can just press this toolbar or uh, press control plus n to launch a new query editor this is the query editor in which we will uh, write at the entire queries we will write the entire schema of our database we will write the entire structure of the database